Musician and performance artist Poppy has been accused of ripping off the style for her new pink jumpsuit. Hey, you're watching What's Trending. I'm Jonathan Harris. Make sure to subscribe for more trending and social media news stories every day. Yesterday, Poppy tweeted out these images of her wearing a bright pink jumpsuit with a P in a triangle on the breast pocket. And the announcement was accompanied with this typically bizarre promotional video. What are you waiting for? My Poppy suit now. This poppy suit will make you live forever. The jumpsuits are currently available on Poppy's website for $150, but Los Angeles-based Big Bud Press is saying that Poppy stole their exact jumpsuit design. In a widely circulated Instagram post, they wrote, I'm Poppy and their team ripped off our jumpsuits identically, LOL. They bought some steeply discounted jumpsuits from us months ago. Then they asked us to make some jumpsuits for them for their tour to sell to customers. We couldn't make them at a price that would be cheap enough for them, so we said no. Then they went ahead and stole our jumpsuit pattern exactly. They alleged that Poppy was wearing one of their jumpsuits throughout her recent live shows. And that may very well be true, though we weren't able to find any video of her wearing a pink jumpsuit on her most recent tour. Big Bud does sell a very similar pink jumpsuit on their website, albeit without the Poppy P on it, for $160. And Big Bud has even more evidence to back up their claims. They featured emails from someone on Poppy's team to Big Bud co-founder Philip Seastrom, asking for discounted or free jumpsuits for their tour and photo shoots. And this makes sense. If you have an established artist that wants to wear and promote your product on tour, that's a pretty good deal for you. But if they then go behind your back to make and then sell their own versions of the jumpsuits without credit, that's pretty messed up. And not great news for Lacey and Philip, the founders of Big Bud Press, who literally just got married last week. This is just the latest allegation of intellectual property theft levied against Poppy and her collaborator, Titanic Sinclair. Back in April, Brittany Sheets, AKA Mars Argo, sued the pair for copyright infringement, alleging that they'd recreated several styles and videos from when Titanic Sinclair had collaborated with her. Mars Argo also accused Titanic Sinclair, real name Corey Mixter, of emotional, physical, and psychological abuse during their personal and professional relationship. Eventually, Sheets left the relationship and collaboration, and shortly thereafter, Poppy showed up with a very similar shtick. few weeks after that lawsuit was filed, Poppy responded on Twitter. She said the allegations were false and accused Sheets of maintaining a romantic relationship with a man who had previously abused her. Neither Poppy nor Titanic Sinclair have responded to these latest allegations of intellectual property theft. So what do you guys think? Does Poppy owe Big Bud Press an apology? And some money? Or is a pink jumpsuit just a pink jumpsuit? Be sure to like this video, subscribe to What's Trending, and for more stories like this, head over to whatstrending.com. Pachow!